Okay, this is going to be a quick demo showing you how to set up Easy Wedge. And the way we do that, if you look on the right side, this is a, a view of the screen of the barcode reader. On the left side, is I've got Easy Wedge working. And here's Notepad. I'm going to be transferring into Notepad just for uh, examples. And so first I'm going to do, I have to install Easy Wedge. I have to hook up the uh, Ethernet adapter to the CK3 dock port and then I'm ready to set up everything. So um, the PC, if you can see here at this little where I'm putting my cursor, is looking for an IP address here of 192.168.0 and 12. It's going to be different on different computers, but uh, whatever yours says, that's what you're going to be putting in, and you're going to be leaving the, uh, the port, at whatever the default is, it's best to leave it. Now, <clears throat> on the right side, I'm going to go to my options. I'm going to click on my options, and then once it opens up, I can set up uh, the device so that it can talk to EasyWedge. So I click on options. I put in the default password, which is five zeros. And then I'm going to click on this comms tab at the bottom. It's set up already, but normally what you would see is that KWedge is set up. You're going to click on Easy Wedge through TCP IP. You're going to put in the same IP at port uh, as your computer, which is there. And then uh, really that's all you have to do. And you're going to validate that it's communicating by clicking on the validate here. And if you got everything set up properly, it's going to say connection confirmed. If you get something different than that, then there's something not set up properly. Now, going back over here to Easy Wedge, if uh, I'm ready to transfer data, uh, actually, going back over to the to this part of it, click Done, Menu, and Escape, and get into one of the programs that you want to collect data on. I'll have three records here. I'm not going to delete them. I'm just going to show you the transfer. So, the number two transmit data is activated now. So we're on the old way of transmitting through K wedge, this was not um, visible. And what we had to do was hit something on K wedge to transfer. With Easy Wedge, all we have to do is push two to transmit data from the unit itself, from the barcode reader. So I click that and um, let's see. Then you hit the enter here. And the data will appear in the in the um, below in the notepad. And when you're done, you're you're done, and you just uh, you're ready to click X here and move on to the next barcode reader. Now you're going to not be transferring through Notepad. You're going to be going to Vista, and so you're going to set it up to work with Vista through the options here. Um, I believe the target is what you're going to select. The new target would be, you know, Vista. So you'll set that up and make that the default, and then you're ready to go. When you're on the right side here, when you've transmitted the data and you're, you know, everything's good, then you can del delete the transactions from the file. For, until then, I just say no. But um, and then you're ready to go back and collect more data. That's pretty much it.